Hello, I'm Jackson, and this is my final milestone for my Blue Stamp project. So I did the robotic arm, and for my final milestone, I ended up transitioning it away from Arduino to a Raspberry Pi, because in the future, uh, in my next session, I plan to uh, basically automate it in ways that the Arduino would not be able to do, but a mini computer like a Raspberry Pi can. So I rewired all of the servos, I took them out of this, and I used jumper wires, you can see going along here, into a breadboard. And then I put wires going from the breadboard to the Arduino. So you can see the ground and the 5 volt line and uh, for each you know, channel that the servo has. I'm using the breadboard. Uh, and so then what was required was to code uh, in Python on the Arduino so that the servos could actually work. So. Uh, in Python, I did a couple days of research to figure out how to work with the servos and how to code them and how the wiring all worked with our with the Raspberry Pi, because I've never worked with servos before on a Raspberry Pi. And then I was able to program a loop for a couple of the servos. I'm not going to show all of them in a loop because then it'll start swinging around everywhere. Um, but I will demonstrate a loop of a couple of the servos. You can see there's the claw and there's it moving back and forth. And it's just a quick loop just to demonstrate. So now I'll be able to do in the future um, what I want with the software where I want it to essentially mimic the movement of my arm using image recognition software. Um, yeah, a couple of the a couple of the challenges I've already talked about with some of the parts challenges, but um, with this with this final milestone, the research aspect was a lot of the challenge. I had to learn something I didn't know about. I had never, I've worked with Raspberry Pis before, but I had never done any servo movement, so I had to learn all about post width modulation, how that works uh, with the servos, and then how to wire it, and I've used a breadboard before, but I don't know, I didn't know the pins on the Raspberry Pi very well, so I had to learn about that as well. Um, so yeah, that's my final milestone.